I like to present innovative solution of the rotor engine with the spark ignition. The engine have separated sections of the compressions. Thanks to that, our cyclists are working simultaneously. Rotor divides working cycles of the engine on two zones, cold and hot. The cold is on the interior side of the cam and relays the function of suction and compress of air. Hot is on the outward, relays the cycles working and escalation. All cycles working symmetrically because this engine has two combustion space and two compressions. The construction of the engine is very simple. The rotor is this red part. Yellow elements are gaskets. The engine does not need the starter, the oil pump, the trimming gear and the cooling system. Every part has independent air coolant. The lubrication happens by periodic injection the oil has to suction and chambers. The rotor works also as the ventilator. It sucks air to the center of the engine. So it looks after assemblage. Please to himself to imagine the engine which take in the car less place than spear wheel, which has also about 300 horsepower and huge the torque. Let us see as it works. The combustion space expands curvature during about 160 degrees of the piston's rotation. Use the practically all energy of combustion gas. This is the moment of the ignition. The valve opens ventilation ducts of the rotor, follow the fuel, fuel ignition and the spark ignition. Ventilation ducts working in one direction. For the simplify, I did not demonstrate in this animation. The working side is continuing. Still. Still, 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 still. In this moment, it follows open duct of expiratory and begins the next cycle of work. Inside is a lot of place, enough on the location of the electric generator, for example. I know this soon I will present the film from the actuation of the prototype. To thank for the attention.